again this is ABM graphics yes welcome back to the week and today being Wednesday I just want us to talk about Photoshop action how to create Photoshop action and uh, Photoshop uh, action is one of the features of uh, Adobe Photoshop and it's just like automate your edits with photoshop actions and it will look beautiful you know whether you are retouching or adding retro effects actions help your work faster and more efficiently while preserving your creative touch yes and this one to speed up your work in every angle and and when you create it action that look beautiful no out of that is going to be very beautiful and you know it's it, it, so actions speed up your editing and your graphic design workflow with actions you get that yes so this today i just want us to talk about that particular photoshop adobe photoshop actions and this is just a user build series of recorded tags or commands that uh that you can play back and record on single or multiple files and these two they are similar to micro or shortcut in that can help you automate your what your tax very easy so let's just go to photoshop and i'll take you through so right now there is my photoshop and what i need to do is this i just want to create a new document and if actions always appeared over here but if you can find your actions what you need to do is to go to windows then you get actions or you can just press alternate f9 to, for your actions to appear you get that yes and this are my actions and you can see there are a whole lot of actions there but to get you can click on this uh, double uh, double lines over here and this one bottom mode you close it up so that you can read the names and all so these are actions that i downloaded from friends and uh, you know a youtubers yes and it's very beautiful and i normally use it every blessed day if i want and i also create my own abm graphics that i normally use yes so right now how do you create the action in photoshop yes so that your workflow will be easy and to do you know you don't have to waste much time when you are doing so however we need to create an action right now i just want to create an action that blur a background you get that that blur a background yes how do you do that so first of all let's just go to file then i'll just import in any kind of picture and let's see something over there so let me choose this particular image yes this one you get that and i want to make an action or i just want to create an action and it will blur all this background leaving the people you know leaving the two couples over there how do you do that in photoshop so first of all what i need to do right now is that i've just opened my foot i've just opened my actions over here like this and you can see a whole lot of actions you get that but because i want to create new action that also works with blend and background what i need now is that first of all i'll come and create a group over here this one when i create that particular group i'll call it blend background and then i'll press enter you see it over here so this is blur background what action what grouped so the next thing i have to do is to come up with another uh, layer and that particular layer will be action layer then is this one then i'll just click on it so right now this one i'll call it blur 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 okay and uh, over this one I'll just set it to blur background which is the same thing over here so it means that I want this blur to be under this one you get that yes and you can also add function key to it or you can also add any color to it so let us use yellow for instance okay and then after that I'll click record so that it will record anything that I'm going to do from now so I'll click and then it has it has just 
started recording like that you can see this one has started this one stopping it and this one playing it okay so right now the first thing that i have to do is that before it will blow it will blend my background i want it to do what to duplicate a layer so i'll press ctrl j it duplicate this layer and you can see layer view cut you get that and then the next step i want the action to do is that i want the action to do what to select all these couples or any picture or any subject that is there it should select it so i'll just come and click on this tool magic wall tool over here and when you are using the latest version of photoshop then you just come and click on select subject then when you select sub when you click on select subject you wait and it will select it you get that so i can see that it has just selected my what my uh, uh, uh what is the name it has just selected my subject and these two people is the subject you get that yes so the next thing i have to do is that i want to remove i want to view cut the subject away and leave the background so i'll press ctrl g so that it will do what i want so you can see that it has just do it over there like that you get that yes and the next thing I, I i want to do is that i want to blur the background so this one i'll call that one background and then this one i'll just call it subject this way you get that and the next thing i'll come and select the sub uh, the background layer over there then i'll go to blur a filter blur gazan blur you see that yes and what i need to, to just increase my radius so that it will blur it up how i wanted it to be to blur it up just like this okay and for the tutorial sex I, I just want to make it something like this over there so that you get everything i want so i'll click okay and then when i click okay it means that i have blurred the background this is before and this is after and it's beautiful so the next thing i have to do is to group it and i'll call it blur background and then after that nothing all i have to do it means that my action has just been created like that so i'll just come and click over here it means that i want to stop recording then i'll click yes and when i click it means that everything has recorded and you can find everything here you get that you can find all what i did over here but over here the blur background i want to on this one so that anytime you want to use this particular action you can be adjusting your what your orgasm blur you know if it is 20 you can either your background can say maybe i don't want 20 radius it's 130 then you can be doing it that's why i own this one you get that yes so the next thing i have to do is that let's just see the magic bye i'll just delete what i just do and then i'll just come and select my play you get that then i'll say what play i'll just play play section and it will do everything for me just like this then i'll wait i'll wait is selecting the subject it want me to blur then i'll move my this thing to somewhere that and then i'll click ok and everything has done you see yes let us use different picture and let's see it will be the same thing that we'll get this is this is the picture i'm doing i'm going to use so over there too i'll just come and play and wait for it to select the subject and then play the background at the same time look at something over here you see that so over there are I may decide to reduce the opacity in uh, sorry the radius over there then i'll click ok so it means that it has played a background like that so this one speed up a work maybe when you have different works to do in a day and you want you just have to create your action so that you can be doing it you can create an action for separation of uh, frequency separation you can you know 
do anything you can create any action that uh, in retouching you can create an action when you just play it it will retouch the person do anything to it yes and this is how we create action in photoshop i hope this tutorial is helpful please subscribe to my youtube channel subscribe to my youtube channel and like share and let all your friends know that i'm over here to help to assist and to also guide on photoshop yes thank you very much for watching this is abm graphics and have a nice day bye bye